Our plan is simple. We can stop the spread by staying at home and reducing contact. Now is the time to act. Staying at home is essential. It's a simple but highly effective way to constrain the virus. This is where I work, now you won't see me in town. And if you do, just stay away from me. So where are you when the sun goes down? I hope it's far away from me. Stay far away from me. Just said this is how it's got to be. Get further away from me. Please stay far away from me. My mum knocked on the door and said, Let me in there. You can be in my bubble. Keep your bubble away from me. Let me stay a day or two, I won't be any trouble. Oh, you know I love you, Mum, but I'd rather not give you a fatal flippin' dose of the COVID, so stay the heck away from me. Stay far away from me. Sorry for the language, Mum. At least two metres and maybe three. English people. Get further away from me. Please stay far away. If one person has it and doesn't know they have it and thinks, well, I'll stay home by and large, but I might go and have lunch with a friend, then that's their friend then who will carry it. Six days later, they might then start feeling unwell, but in that time they might have visited a family member. And I get so tired when I have to explain why I want you away from me. See the droplets from your mouth are falling like the rain. Keep that shit away from me. Stay far away from me. I take isolation seriously. Oh, genius, Steve. I'd love to sneak around yours for some cheeky beersies. If I wanted to die! Tell me, what did you see this? Oh yeah, she's good, yeah. Yeah, she's after that, yeah. Everyone's talking about it, yeah. Rosalie saw it on Facebook, Uncle Matthew saw it on Instagram, Auntie Sasha saw it on TikTok, and Uncle Terry saw it on the dark web. Whatever that means. Just stay far.